in several states across the USA, there have been reports on social media of killer clowns following people. These reports have been revealed as hoaxes or invented stories. There have been a number of arrests, and even the White House has become involved when a spokesman was asked about the creepy clowns. A 14-year-old girl in Towns, New Jersey, posted on Facebook that a clown with a knife had chased her. She was later charged for inventing the story. In the same area, a 12-year-old girl was charged for posting on Instagram from an account titled Killer Clown from NJ, inviting people to take part in killer clown activities. In a separate incident in another county, police responded to a report that two people in a black Toyota wearing clown masks were following another car. After police stopped the car, they charged a 19-year-old driver with dangerous driving and an 18-year-old passenger with possession of marijuana. They also found two clown masks in the vehicle. And in Connecticut, police arrested a 13-year-old boy for making Instagram posts involving clowns and threats. Several other people have been arrested across the USA, in Georgia, Alabama and Virginia. These have included both those making false reports of clown threats or actually chasing people dressed as clowns. Police have said that dressing as a creepy clown and walking around isn't strictly illegal. However, they warned that you will be arrested for following people, knocking on doors or sending threatening messages on social media, etc. Stephen King, the world-famous horror writer whose novel It featured a monster dressed as a clown, had this to say on Twitter. Hey, guys, time to call the clown hysteria. Most of them are good. Cheer up the kiddies. Make people laugh.